I'm Whitney Fowkes. We're following the updates on the spread of the coronavirus. Here's the latest. Governor Kristi Noem held a news conference on the COVID-19 numbers early this afternoon. She has signed a state of emergency order for the state of South Dakota. She also asked schools to close statewide starting next week. Another press conference was held at 245 where she met with Sanford and Avera Health to continue to develop a plan for COVID-19. Noem also says more coronavirus tests are coming to the state. You can read more on this story online right now. During a Rose Garden press conference, President Trump declared a national emergency to address the coronavirus pandemic. He did this to open up access to up to $50 billion of funds in the fight against the coronavirus. With the threat of the coronavirus, four groups in the Sioux Falls area have canceled blood drives in a matter of days. That means the community blood bank needs donations. If you'd like to help, you can donate blood at both Avera and Sanford hospitals. More information can be found in this story on Kelloland.com. Rapid City Area Schools held a news conference Friday afternoon to discuss the district's response to COVID-19. They announced Rapid City Area Schools will be closing all schools to prevent the spread of COVID-19 after Governor Nome's recommendation. From the Capitol News Bureau in Pier, turnover among Governor Kristi Nome's staff continued Friday as Press Secretary Kristen Wheelman announced it was her final day. This is the fourth major change in Nome's communications team since she took the oath as governor January 5th, 2019. Read more on this story from Capitol News Bureau reporter Bob Mercer online right now. Scroll down in the first at four story for a look at today's forecast from the Kelloland Live Doppler HD Storm Center. That's first at four on this Friday afternoon. I'm Whitney Fowkes. For the latest updates, download the Kelloland News app. (music) 